There are many exciting mathematics and science initiatives throughout our schools. Our teachers are delivering a comprehensive curriculum aligned to the New Jersey Core Curriculum Content Standards and the National Common Core Standards. There are afforded technological programs and resources to teach mathematics with both procedural and conceptual understanding. Science is taught through an inquiry-based process which fosters cooperative problem solving and collaborative thinking. Students utilize manipulatives and engage in hands-on learning to solidify concepts and develop real-world connections. Throughout this video, you will see several uses of technology implementation, including the iPad Fuse program utilized in our high school mathematics classes, our middle school digits program, and an inquiry-based science project. These are just a few of the wonderful learning opportunities our students are engaging in regularly. This year, following up on the implementation of the Common Core Standards in Mathematics in grades K-2 from last year, we began implementation of the Common Core in grades 3-5 to five mathematics in all our elementary schools. The more in-depth understanding required in the Common Core will be particularly obvious in our 5th grade classrooms during the next 8 or 9 weeks. 55 teachers involved in teaching mathematics in 5th grade recently met together with me and three of our middle school teachers for a full day to help prepare for our 5th graders now using materials that were previously used in our middle schools to help our students develop a deeper understanding of fractions. At the middle school level, our New Digits technology-based program continues to help us prepare the students for the Common Core, which is required to be fully implemented in middle school math next year. Mrs. DiGennaro and Mrs. Ryan are guiding their sixth grade students to analyze tables and graphs by first using the interactive feature of the program that allows students to plot points on a coordinate grid. Mrs. Martins, our district supervisor for mathematics, will share with you some of what is happening in mathematics in our high schools. This year, there are several new and very exciting mathematical initiatives on the high school level. AP Statistics is the new advanced placement course that has been added to both high schools and currently has an enrollment of approximately 90 students between the two schools. This course is extremely beneficial because most college majors require a statistics course. There's also the Algebra 1 Fuse application for the iPad, which is being implemented into the ninth grade Integrated Algebra 1 course. With a touch of a finger, these students will experience this extremely innovative and first of its kind interactive mathematics textbook which is changing the way students learn Algebra 1. With the new block schedule and smart boards in every math classroom, the benefits of the FUSE application for the iPad are endless for our students in becoming fluent in algebraic concepts. Students will have access to lessons, tools, and intervention materials right at their fingertips. The embedded instructional videos will reinforce every lesson and the self-paced, interactive, problem-solving tutorials will allow students to scroll through the steps involved in solving complex algebraic problems. As we move forward, our hope is to expand this amazing technology to other math classes. Mrs. Tiricella's class at Nutswamp School has been working on literacy standards in their science class. Through the use of nonfiction literature, they've been learning about things that are living and non-living, as well as how to make observations and communicate their findings in analyzing owl pellets after the students created story problems involving owls in their math journals. Mrs. Campbell's third grade class at Nut Swamp has extended their study of the water cycle by building terrariums during science, which proved to be an enjoyable and a valuable experience for all involved. Our middle school science teachers continue to find ways to help students understand the content they are teaching through active student involvement and by helping students to relate the science to prior knowledge or experiences. For example, in Mr. Jacobus's classroom at Thompson Middle School, the eighth graders do a kinesthetic activity they are not likely to forget to illustrate why some atoms give away electrons and some steal electrons. In our high schools, teachers are helping students to apply the science they are learning to their lives on a daily basis. DNA extraction has many applications including forensic studies, medicine, and the Human Genome Project. In Mrs. McGimsey's biology class at High School North, students begin their study of DNA by extracting it from strawberries. Teachers throughout the district are finding innovative and exciting ways to help students enjoy learning while working very hard to meet the challenges of implementing our standards-based curricula. We are most grateful for your support in helping your children to further these experiences outside the classroom.